question number 176. Select the incorrect statement with respect to restriction enzymes and the options given are first option they break phosphodiester bonds this is correct second option each restriction endonucleus functions by inspecting the length of a DNA sequence this is also correct third option each restriction enzyme binds to its specific recognition sequence and cut the two strands of the double helix of DNA this is also correct fourth option Restriction enzymes do not cut between the same two bases on the opposite strands of DNA, thereby produce a sticky ends. This is incorrect because restriction enzyme cut between the same two bases on the opposite strands of DNA. So, correct answer to this question is option number four. Moving to the next question. Question number 177, wings of butterfly and wings of birds are examples of and the options given are first option, homologous organs. This is incorrect because wings of butterfly and wings of birds are example of analogous organs. Second option, divergent evolution. This is incorrect because analogous organs arise as a result of convergent evolution and not the divergent evolution. Third option, analogous organs. This is correct. Wings of butterfly and wings of birds are examples of analogous organs. Fourth option, co-evolution. This is incorrect. Host-parasite relationship is an example of co-evolution in which one organism has to evolve all because of the evolution in other organism. Correct answer to this question is option number three. Moving to the next question, question number 178. Which of the following is an incorrect statement with respect to transport of oxygen? And the options given are first option formation of oxyhemoglobin mainly depends on PO2. This is correct. Oxyhemoglobin formation primarily depends on the partial pressure of oxygen. Second option, high PCO2 at tissue level favors the dissociation of oxyhemoglobin. This is correct. Here you can see the oxygen dissociation curve. If this curve, which is sigmoid in shape, shifts to the right side, it indicates dissociation of oxyhemoglobin. And the factors which affects shift to right. are increase in PCO2, decrease in PO2, increase in H plus ion concentration, decrease in pH, increase in temperature and increase in the level of BPG. These factors promote shift to right and occurs at the tissue level. Factors opposite to this promote shift to left and shift to left occurs at alveolar level. Third option, low pH at alveolar level favors the formation of oxyhemoglobin. This is incorrect. High pH at alveolar level favors the formation of oxyhemoglobin. Fourth option, low PCO2 at alveolar level favors the formation of oxyhemoglobin. This is correct. At alveolar level, PCO2 is less and PO2 is more and that favors the formation of oxyhemoglobin. So the incorrect one is option three and correct answer to this question is option number three. Moving to the next question. Question number 179, select the neutral amino acid from the following and the options given are first option glutamic acid. Glutamic acid is an acidic amino acid. Acidic basic or neutral amino acid, this depends on the number of carboxylic and amino group in an amino acid. For example, in case of glutamic acid, This is a structure of glutamic acid and in glutamic acid,
extra COH group is present. So this is an acidic amino acid. Second option, lysine. Lysine is a basic amino acid. So this cannot be a correct answer. First option, glutamic acid is also not a correct answer. Let's see structure of lysine. In the R group, extra NH2 is present. So, lysine is a basic amino acid. Third option, valine. Valine is a neutral amino acid because in the structure of valine, only one NH2 and one carboxylic acid group are present. So, correct answer to this question is option number three. Fourth option, tyrosine. This is an aromatic amino acid. So, this cannot be a correct answer. Let's see structure of tyrosine also. This is structure of tyrosine. Because of this ring, tyrosine is an aromatic amino acid. So correct answer to this question is option number three. Question number 180, match the organism with its use in biotechnology. A. Bacillus thuringiensis. Insecticidal protein coding gene that is cry gene is obtained from Bacillus thuringiensis. So A matches with 3. B. Thermus aquaticus. Pack polymerase, a thermostable DNA polymerase is obtained from Thermus aquaticus, a thermophilic bacterium. So B matches with 2. C. Agrobacterium tumefaciens. Modified TI plasmid of Agrobacterium tumefaciens is used as cloning vector to deliver our desired gene in variety of plants. So C matches with fourth E. coli, that is a Sherichia coli. It is host cell for insulin production. So D matches with 1. Let's see this combination is given in which option? A with 3, B with 2, C with 4 and D with 1. This is given in option number 1. Moving to the next question. Mm -hmm.